The big problem is that even though everyone is pursuing personalized medicine, it doesn't work yet. We're still doing trial and error treatments because someone receives a personalized medicine and then they stop responding to it. The problem is that we measure the success of a cancer treatment in months of survival instead of whether a patient is cured or not. And so what we're developing is a, is a tool that maps the different types of cells and mutations in a tumor. Our technology uh, processes patient biopsies and returns information that can be used for drug discovery, for screening patients, and ultimately to recommend treatments. We've gone from a prototype proof of concept uh, to an alpha instrument working with uh, pharma companies and diagnostic companies. Um, we've started an early access program for our technology with collaborators in Europe and Australia. We're moving forward with discovery projects that translates us from research to commercial applications in life science. And over the last 18 months, we've also secured over one and a quarter million dollars in funding from the National Science Foundation and the National Cancer Institute. We're not just an Arizona company, we're going to make an impact all over the world. But we stay here because this is where our roots are. We started here. ASU and CEI got us going. The Flynn Foundation moved us from our kitchens into a real laboratory. The workforce here is great. We have everything we need. And we can tap into the expertise of other areas. We've had ups and downs. We've uh, worked with customers and it didn't work out. And we worked with customers and it went great. We've had things fail. We've had things fail every day. And then you come in and you fix them and you make them work. Uh, and you have to just be driven with the mission. And the mission is to eliminate drug resistance in cancer patients. The mission is to eliminate trial and error treatments. And keeping in mind that success is not just an exit for the company. Success is someone living longer, someone spending more time with their family. That keeps us going.